What's up, y'all? It's Slime Green Beast in the building, and today I got a special video for y'all. We're gonna be using the Edison editor, and we're gonna be time stretching sounds. But before I get started, make sure you check out our website, slimegreenbeats.com, and you can get our how to mix beats book, how to make beats, melodies, shirts, everything that you could ever need. So make sure to check that out and subscribe and join our new subscription plan that we got going on now, so you can get special access to us. But let me just start right here. So uh, this is the first series I wanted to start out on the Edison editor. If you don't know about what the Edison editor is, it's a uh, it's a sound editor. Uh, you really people just use them for sampling or to edit sounds. So you could sample a sound like you could clap in real life, put the sound in here, and it's going to let you have a lot of tools to edit. So um, one of the big areas right here is the tools, and you can find the Edison editor uh, right up here open up it will say new audio editor edison master and then you can really just like drag sounds in here so here's the sound and you can see the waveform let me just hit the play button and it really just gives you a lot more control of the sound what you want to do to it um, like you can pan it left right change the volume separate it um, but for this video here today i just want to talk about how you can pitch shift a sound so you can have a lot more control of it. So here's a clap or a snare. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna highlight this. I'm gonna open up the tools and I'm gonna go down to time stretch pitch shift. And now I just play that sound and then I can edit the pitch right here. So. Can make it sound lower or higher pitch so this this actually is really useful um it gives you that extra layer of flexibility like this right here sounds like a metro booming snare if you've been trying to make it that sound or you have a snare sound or anything that you just want to fine tune and then uh, they have this fine tune adjustment i don't really think there's too much going on over there uh but you're gonna get a lot more uh shift on the tone with a pitch course and then you know you got your fine tune and then you can change your time uh make that time stretch out make it sound like the weekend uh, like that so it'll give you just some control you can make some good sounds with it again just get creative with it and then i don't really mess with the method uh but yeah that's how you pitch shift and that's how you uh, time stretch a sound. So uh, let me know what y'all think of the video. Uh, again, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys like. And, you know, I'm going to open up this Edison series and uh, get it popping. So it's Slime Green Beats.